we're invited to have our lives baptized by the Holy Spirit. Without that baptism, this baptism means nothing. Without that ongoing baptism, this baptism is punctiliar. It happens once. With that baptism, we receive the freshness and the beauty of Christ day by day. Jesus comes to us and he makes us aware of our need. We determine whether or not we will respond to that need by surrendering our hearts and receiving the gift of repentance. When we repent, Jesus assures us that his grace is sufficient. This baptism represents the choice, not the power to be different, but the choice to be different. The power to be different is Christ. The choice to be different is ours. When we choose, Jesus says, I am your strength. I am your provision. I will remake your heart. I will change your desires. So as a teenager, nurtured by parents, by schools, by pastors, by teachers, probably by other youth ministries, Krista has determined today that Jesus is safe Jesus is God, and Jesus is King. So now, Krista, because you love Jesus, because you want to serve him all the days of your life, because you want to live with him in heaven, because he's made a way for that, that heaven can begin in your heart now, and it has, because you love him and serve him, and because you want to say that to everybody that's here today, I baptize you as a messenger of the gospel in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Let's pray. Father, send the Holy Spirit into Christa's heart again right now. Give her a sweet peace that Jesus and his friendship is the best friendship in the world. May he be first best and always every day of her life. May she be a missionary wherever she goes. May she be a witness of the goodness of God all the days of her life. Bless all who come now to celebrate with her and bless us in your house. What a great thing. May we rejoice with heaven today in Jesus' name.